So can a 3D printed whistle really work and how loud can it really get? We're about to find out, so stick around. Okay, I, I got on Thingiverse and I found this Whistle V29. It's really super popular and a lot of people are like, oh, it doesn't work. And other people are like, oh, mine works great. Your printer must be calibrated wrong or something. So I wanted to find out for myself. So I printed out two whistles. Um, one of them is the V29 model and one of them is the V29 fixed, which I think just has the um, V29 logo removed from it. There might be some other differences in uh, slight uh, tolerances and stuff like that. I don't know. Uh, but other than that, they look pretty much the same. Um, so I printed these from PLA Plus. Um, I used 2.2 millimeter layers and um, uh, about, I don't know, 10% infill, just a little bit of infill just in case. I don't think it really needs it though. Um, definitely no support because any support will clog up the workings of it. Uh, my printer, the Up Plus 2, likes to put support underneath things like where it thinks it needs it, even if you tell it not to use support. So I had to clean out support from these little ridges on the underside of the print. So I've got both of them cleaned up and uh, ready to test them out. Now the Thingiverse page claims that these will hit 118 decibels. So that's pretty loud. Um, I'm going to get out a decibel meter in a minute and we'll find out if that's really true. But let's uh, start off by just finding out, you know, do these even work at all? So this is the V29, uh, regular V29 whistle. So here we go. That's that's pretty loud. Um, all right, let's try V29 fixed. Also pretty loud. My ears actually hurt a little bit. Um, all right, let's get out the, uh, the decibel meter and let's find out what we measured. I've got a uh, decibel meter right here on the phone. And I'm going to stand one meter away from it because I'm pretty sure that's how you're supposed to measure decibels. Um, I'll put this, put this over here. Um, well, let's try to get all in the scene here. Okay, so, okay, I'm about a meter away right now. I hope you can still see me. Um, so, hmm, well, we got a big spike, but it didn't, it's not 118. Let's try this one. Um, so that maxed out at 86.8 decibels. Um, quite honestly, I don't know if this thing can measure a lot more than that. Um, also, I probably could have blown harder into it, but I don't want the neighbors to come knocking on my door wondering what's going on in here. Uh, so we can comfortably say that it, it generates at least 90 decibels. I mean that's a, that's a that's a given. That's that's a pretty good whistle. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, this fun little test. Uh, this whistle is actually a lot louder than I really thought it would be. Uh, it'll hurt your ears. Um, so we've confirmed that it does work as designed. Um, if you want to print one for yourself, I'll put a link down below uh, so you can download it and print it out yourself. And um, I'll also put links to my uh, social media and all that stuff. Um, so. If I didn't say this already, don't forget to subscribe for more awesome videos, and uh, I will see you next time. So thanks for watching.